House of Zwede. Zakaria urges Nkosi and Funani to return with him to KwaZulu Natal to conduct a more appropriate Okubuyisa ceremony for Mankhidi. Zakaria feels that the initial rituals were insufficient and wants to ensure that all traditional rites are properly observed. He stresses the importance of honoring Mankhidi's spirit in a way that fully respects their cultural heritage. The urgency in Zakaria's voice leaves little room for debate, and Kosi and Funani reluctantly agree. They recognize the significance of the ceremony and the need to do it correctly. After quickly packing their belongings, they prepare for the journey. Before their departure, there is a strained farewell between Faith and Zakaria. The atmosphere is thick with unresolved tensions as unspoken words and lingering emotions hung heavily in the air. Faith's expression reveals a mixture of concern and frustration, while Zakaria remains stoic. He's focused solely on the upcoming ceremony. As the night falls, they live under the cover of darkness, each of them silently contemplating the importance of their mission. The drive to KwaZulu Natal is long and somber, filled with moments of reflection and silent prayers for Mahidi's peaceful transition. Zakaria and Kosi and Funani each feel the weight of their responsibilities and uh, they understand that performing the Okubuisa ceremony properly is crucial for the peace of Mahidi's spirit and for the healing of their family. The road ahead is not just a physical journey but a spiritual one demanding their full commitment and respect for their traditions. This journey filled with personal and cultural significance marks a profound moment for each of them, highlighting the deep-rooted values and unbreakable bonds within their family. In the comment section, tell me how you feel and what you think about all of this in the house of Zwede.